you know, I felt good before the fight. I, you know, I trained forever, it seems like, for this with, uh, you know, Coach Trevor Whitman and me, Mark Cord and Christian Allen. So, uh, you know, my confidence was there as far as conditioning and, and uh, the technical stuff. And uh, when you do all that stuff and, and put things in the right place, I, I felt comfortable before the fight. Uh, you know, a couple of days before the fight, my nerves got to me a little bit, but I uh, just relaxed and, you know, let things be. And, um, but right before the fight, once I got warmed up, you know, I was ready to go and I felt great and uh, I was excited to get out there and fight. Oh, man, it was, uh, <laughs> you know, completely excitement, you know. I don't know if I've ever been that excited even after I won the national championship in wrestling. So, uh, uh, it was great to be there and it was such an experience and, uh, you know, the UFC treated me really well. Yep. And, uh, you know, I was, I was excited for me and my teammates and my coaches and my family and all my friends as well. So you plan on sticking with the UFC for a while? Uh, yeah, I hope so, as long as they keep me around. Well, what is your past fighting experience? What organizations have you fought with? Um, you know, my very first fight was with the WEC, and that was when they were still based in Lamar, California. And um, I, I, I fought for X1 and Ultimate Texas Showdown. And, uh, you know, my last couple, uh, I fought in uh, the Art of War as well as the Ring of Fire. So I've been to several different promotions. And who manages you? Um, you know, I don't have a manager, and uh, I like it that way. My management team is, uh, you know, my uh, coach Trevor and uh, uh, Mark Court and uh, Christian Allen. So it's uh, all my trainers and me come together and collaborate on it. And that's at what gym that you train at? Uh, I train at Chief Kale. And, and it's in uh, Wee Ridge, Colorado. And, right outside Denver, a suburb of Denver, Colorado. And you mentioned um, making your family proud. Now, um, are you in a relationship? Is this your wife, your parents? Um, give me some family background. Oh, yeah. You know, I have a, a wonderful fiance, Lonnie, that's, uh, you know, been completely supportive. And she goes out to the fights with me and hangs out with me. And, uh, you know, she's been by my side the whole time. And, and it's, it's been wonderful. And, uh, you know, I love her very much. And uh, also, I seven-year-old son, Camden, and, uh, you know, he's an avid soccer player, so uh, I think, uh, you know, he told me, I told me he could be anything in the world that he wanted to be, and he said that he wants to be a professional soccer player. Oh, wonderful. Uh, Good. Uh, yeah. And so <laughs> uh, I have, uh, you know, my mom raised three boys on her own, and, um, and then my two brothers as well. And so, uh, so um... Um, I'm thinking you've racked up some fans. Uh, what what can your fans expect from you in the future? Uh, you know, I'm a you know I'm a normal guy, and I get down to earth, and uh, you know, approachable, and uh, you know, I like to go out and I like to fight. That's what I love to do, and uh, and uh, you know, finish fights quick. I like to be exciting, and you know, I think that's just my my uh, fighting style is explosive. Yeah, I was thrilled, I'll tell you, Shane. And um, I'm really looking forward to more fights from you in the future and being able to speak to you again, having more interviews with you. And I really appreciate the knockout because I loved it. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. Oh,